Administrative Functions in ETP Enterprise Application Server, or EAS. Centralized User and Security Configuration. In User Group, we can define different user groups based on their roles to easily manage the users of ETP Enterprise Application Server and ETP Store. In User, we can define users and assign them to their user groups in ETP Enterprise Application Server. To demonstrate, let us create a new user named Gina and assign her to the Finance User Group. We can also do the same for the users in ETP Store. To demonstrate, let us create a new user named Gila and assign her to the Sales User Group in US 11 Retail Store. In security, we can manage the access to ETP Enterprise Application Server and ETP Store at the User Group, User, Module, and Function levels. To demonstrate, let us change the Store User Group module authorization for the Manager User Group in US 11 Retail Store. Centralized Employee Configuration In Employee Type Master, we can define different employee types based on their roles to easily manage the employees at the stores. In Employee Master, we can define employees and assign them to the stores they will be working at and their employee types. To demonstrate, let us create a new employee named Fiona Harn and assign her to the sales employee type in US 11 Retail Store. Centralized POS Configuration In POS Configuration, we can control the store operations by deploying the configurations of all stores centrally. We can create and define configuration templates for invoice printing, credit note, customer search, item search, email setup, counter, storefront, and store operations. As an example, let us take a look at one of the configuration templates of invoice printing. Next, we can assign the attributes from the configuration templates to the stores. To demonstrate, let us assign the attributes from one of the invoice printing configuration templates. We can assign the attributes based on division, facility, store type, store category, store class, place, country, or store. In this scenario, we will assign the attributes to all stores under Division 902. Alternatively, we can configure each store individually in store configuration. To demonstrate, let us assign the attributes from one of the invoice printing configuration templates to Retail Store US 11.
Centralized Reports In ETP Enterprise Application Server, we can generate over 70 different reports. For some reports, like Sales Report, we can select a division, all stores, or a specific store, a date range, and generate the report in detail or summary. As we can see, this is the detailed sales report of Retail Store US 11 today. Centralized Inquiry In ETP Enterprise Application Server, we can perform an item search based on multiple criteria to quickly view the inventory balance, price, and other information of multiple items in all stores or a specific store. We can also perform a customer search based on multiple criteria to quickly view the contact information, loyalty points, purchase value, purchase quantity, and other information of multiple customers. This customer search result can be exported into an Excel file for customer relationship management purposes.